Let's graph the linear equation for y equals 1 fourth x. We'll do it two ways. First, we'll fill some values in for a table and then plot those points. Then we'll check our work with slope intercept form. So let's put some values in. I'm going to start out by putting a value of 4 in for x because if 1 fourth times 4, that gives me 1. So I could say x is 4 and then y would equal 1. That makes it a little bit easier to graph and that'll show up on my graph here as well. Let's put a 0 in for x. So 1 fourth times 0, that just gives us 0. How about negative 4? 1 fourth times negative 4, that'll just give us a negative 1. So these are the points that we'll graph for the linear equation y equals 1 fourth x. We could have put any values in and those will work fine. Just these give us whole numbers here, which is kind of nice. So let's start out by going to x is 4, 1, 2, 3, 4, and y is 1. Then we have x is 0 and y is 0. So here's x is 0 and y is 0. Finally, we have negative 4, 1, 2, 3, 4, and y is negative 1. And you can see these all line up. We could put a line through them. Then we'll put arrows to show that it goes to infinity. And these are the points for the linear equation y equals 1 fourth x. Again, we could have put other numbers in and they would all show up on this line somewhere. We could have also gotten away with just using two points, but I like doing three. Then if I have an error in one of them, it'll show up. Let's check our work with slope intercept form. So we have y equals mx plus b. We have our slope, one fourth, we have x, but we don't have b. So we just consider b to be zero. That means the y intercept, the line will intercept the y axis right here at zero. So we have our y intercept and the slope, the one fourth, we can consider that to be rise over run. So we can go to our y intercept, which we said was zero, and then we can go up one and over one, two, three, four. From there, we can go up one again and over one, two, three, four. And these points, they're on our line. Likewise, we could go in the opposite direction. We can start at this y intercept, go down one and over one, two, three, four. That shows up and then down one and over one, two, three, four. And that shows up on our line as well. So this is the correct graph for the linear equation y equals one fourth x. And this is Dr. B. Thanks for watching.